Hello friends and how are you all today? My name is Priyanka and I shall be helping you with the following question. It says a bill was drawn in April 4, 2004 at 8 months after date and was discounted on July 14, 2004 at 5% per annum. If banker's gain is rupees 2000, find the face value of the bill. Let the face value of the bill be equal to rupees S. Further, we are given banker's gain that is BG equal to rupees 200. Further, we are given rate of interest as 5% per annum. Now, let us find out the due date of the bill. That is the legal due date. We are given the date of drawing the bill as 4th April 2004. So the legal due date of the bill will be for 8 months 4th December 2004 plus 3 days of grace. So it is equal to 7th December 2004. The period of this bill was 8 months. Further, we are given discounting date of the bill as July 14th, 2004. So, period of discount is for the month of July, August, September, October, November and December. It is in the month of July, there are 17 days left. In the month of August, there are 31, then 30, then 31, 30 and then here it was legally due date was 7 December. So here, month of December, there are 7 days. So in all, there are 146 days that on converting in year. will give us two by five year. Now we know that banker's gain is equal to banker's discount minus true discount. So we have banker's gain is given to us as 200. Banker's discount is face value of the bill into rate that is 5 upon 100 that can be written as 1 upon 20 into period of discount that is 2 by 5 minus again S into R into T upon 1 plus R into what we need to do further is we just need to simplify it. We have 200 equal to S upon 50 whole upon 1 minus S upon 50 upon 1 plus 1 upon 50. Further, we have 
200 equal to S upon 50 minus S upon 50 divided by 51 upon 50. That is 200 is equal to S upon 50 minus S upon 51. That is 200 is equal to LCM will be 15 to 51 in the numerator. Now we have 51S minus 50S. So we have 200 into 50 into 51 equal to S. Which on simplifying comes out to be 5,10,000. That is equal to S which is the face value of the bill. So therefore face value of the bill is rupees 5,10,000. Right, so this completes the session. Hope you understood it well. Do take care of your calculations and have a very nice day ahead.